think at each spot, I, I feel like I'm one of the best at each spot. I feel like I was one of the best point guards in the, in the Big Ten last year. So, and when I came out, that's what I tried to prove, that I was one of the best. And I'm going to do that this year at the two. I do it at all three positions. I think we all here want to play in this double tournament. Um, I know I want to. Um, as an individual, going to do whatever it takes to get there. And I think each player has said that for them too. Um, it was definitely a great experience. Not an experience I want to experience again, though. But it was a good experience for, for us at the time. Uh, I think we, that was something we needed to be able to take the next step and really, and really uh, grasp the feeling of being able to play past the Big Ten tournament. Since, since I've been playing basketball, always led by example. Uh, so it's something new for me. Uh, everybody around me knows that. My coaching staff knows that. So they, they're, they're pushing me, but they're giving me time. So that's not something that's going to happen overnight. Not going to happen like that. Uh, I just want to be dominant. I want to, I want to come in every game. I want people to say he was dominant, whether I was scoring, defensively, rebounding. I just want to be known as a dominant player. So that's what I'm, my goal is this year to be the most dominant player on the court. Sales of every time to kid, he's gonna surprise me. I didn't know how good he was gonna be, you know, I hadn't seen him. Yeah. And I heard about this 5'11 kid from Nebraska, or <laughs> yeah, wherever he was from. So I wanted to see him in person. I've been impressed with him. So I think every play is important to our success. From the walk ons down, we need people, everybody to do their job. So whatever the freshmen, uh, whatever roles coach give them, or whatever they carve out for, for themselves, we intend to do that. Whether it's the fan come in, play relief minutes, uh, I think two of our freshmen may be starting, I'm not really sure. So you know, everybody needs to just do their job, from myself as a junior to them, to everybody. Like, everyone's important, because right now, you know, we're trying to be an elite team, and we all need each other more than anything, and that's what we can't forget that. I feel like I'm the same, you know, I'll be the same lunch pill guy night in, night out, but uh, I think a lot of, you know, I've learned a lot more stuff that, you know, that could help me in this year, like footwork and uh, defensively, and. Uh, I learned a lot of different moves when I was down in, you know, in Europe from stuff like that, and I just learned I have to be more creative with my game uh, to be able successful in the long run. So I'll t I am I am vocal. I'd say that, but uh, you know, I'll tell guys when they need it, you know, you know, need to be told stuff, and you know, when they need to be, t you know, what they need to do here and there, and I've done that already, I think, and um, you know, I'm the type of person at least by playing and also, you know, talking to guys and making sure they understand what they need to do. So, um, yeah, I mean, I'm willing, I am going to talk to people and make sure they know that, and that's what a leader needs to do on his team. So we have, we have talent and we have depth and we have everything we want in a good team. It's just, what, I mean, what we need to know is, are these guys going to come in night in, night out? You know, what it requires every night is to bring hard work. And, uh, you know, we can't have a down night like we've had, you know, have in the past. So. Um, you know, we have that, you know, people talk about we have that depth and talent, but, you know, it, you know, it's, we need effort and hard work and stuff like that to be able to be an NCAA team and uh, more, you know, even keep, carry on even more towards that. So. Yeah, like uh, somebody asked earlier about the depth, um, you know, the first thing it does, it, it, it makes good practices. You know, you got a lot of guys, they're going to be going hard and, you know, good competitiveness. But the other thing, I'm not, I don't know as much as you guys, anyone else does about the lineup. So. Everyone's gonna be working hard for minutes and see where the minutes fall, and it'll be fun. You know, expectations are obviously different this year than they were last year. Last year, no one. You know, I was I was one of the guys around here that no one really came up to and asked a lot of questions to. So, um, you know, it, it's a good feeling, but you know, you also know that you have a lot, a lot expected of you, and you have to you bring it every game. And the defensive game plans are gonna be different from the other TCAA tournament. Uh, every guy you ask you, that's gonna be their answer. Um, that's the goal to be the top. I think it's 64 now, or whatever they say. Yeah, you know, uh, the, the five freshmen are great. Uh, you know, they came in and bonded real well with our team. Uh, they're in the gym a lot. They're working hard, and, you know, they got a lot of talent. So We've had great workouts uh, this summer and uh, this fall, so, uh, this far. And, uh, you know, I, I think the sky's the limit for us. Uh, you know, it just kind of depends on, you know, how fresh, the, how fast the freshmen adapt, uh, you know, because they got a lot of talent, and, uh, you know, we're going to need them. Definitely, everyone I see, everyone I see on campus, the students, even a few teachers, they always ask me, "How are we going to do this year? How are we going to do?" It? I'm telling them, I always tell them the same thing. We're just improving every day. I'm mean, just trying to trying to figure some things out, but we'll be ready for when the season starts. For people that don't come to the workouts, what are the battles with you and Adam like? How hard do you guys go? Oh, 
I think we both got sore chests from all the elbows that are going on. But, um, I think the main thing, we'll get, we're both getting each other better. Um, it's kind of like yin and yang to a certain extent. He's seven foot, he's a low down low. I'm, I'm 6'11 and I'm athletic, so it just helps us um, in terms of matchups for the season. We're going to see a lot of athletic big guys, and we're going to see a lot of big guys that we can't move off the block, so it just helps us both. I mean, all I, all I really hear is excitement, um, and I, I don't I don't look at the expectations that they have for us. Um, all of our goals for a team come from within our team. Um, we don't look for uh, outside motivations, and I definitely think that we're going to have some great fan support this year, and I think that's that's what's going to help us too. It's it's been my dream since I was little. Um, I'm basically getting to live my dream right now, and just trying to stay focused and, and continue to work hard. Um, I almost feel like a, a little kid in a candy store. Um, just that's how excited I am. What role will this freshman class ultimately play in this team's success this year? Hopefully a big role. I mean, that's that's the goal. I mean, we obviously got a great group coming back. I mean, they're pretty young, but they're pretty experienced. So, I mean, they know what's going on, and uh, hopefully we can just fill in where we need to. Adam, what are the what are the battles like with you and, and Gabe in practice? I mean, they're, they're, I mean, we're going at each other every time we can. we got a great mutual respect for each other. And, uh, I mean, I watched him play last year, and he's really taken great steps in his game. I hope, hope that I have, too. What is it with that? With the free throws, I mean, is it a, is it a mental thing? I worked a lot on it this summer over the last couple of months with Coach Barra, and uh, I think they've really improved a lot. I changed up my or my rhythm of the shot, my release, so hopefully I can uh, make them at a higher rate this year. How are you and Mike different? We've we've kind of heard how you guys are the same. How do you feel you're different? Uh, I think I'm more of a slasher. He's more of a shooter. Uh, I mean, we're both athletic. Uh, I mean, he can pass, I can pass. I think what separates our game uh, is just I attack more. You know, he shoots more. Uh, I mean, he's a scoring point guard. I'm more of a distributor. So, I mean, I think us playing together, that will help a lot. What kind of battles is going to be between you and Mike for minutes for the season, you know? That's uh, right. I mean, it's going to be a battle. I mean, you know, everybody wants to start. Everybody wants to play, you know. I mean, if the battle is me and him on the court together, then hey, that's what it is. Whenever it happens, you know, it happens. I mean, if we're winning, then we're winning, you know. We're winning with him playing more minutes, then I'm fine with that.